In this video we'll be showing how to use the personal tab on Swoop for Teams. When you start Swoop for Teams, the application will commence showing your personal interactions on Teams. The information on this tab are secured to yourself. Starting with the personal tab is purposeful. We believe that change happens at the individual level. When you can see the way that you are working, you are far better placed to change your work patterns if required. The personal tab collects your personal activities across all teams that you are active in. I'll illustrate here how the personal tab works by looking at my, my own personal analytics for, for teams. As you can see here uh, at Swoop we're pretty early into teams, we've been very big Yammer users. but uh, So you can see here the activity is not so high but uh, this is the things that I've contributed to my teams in Swoop and this is what I've got back. This is sort of the same that you'll see in the Yammer product Swoop for Yammer. And uh, at the personal tab level, at least, they're pretty much the same. Uh, we have personas here and a, and a network map. I guess the network map draws your eyes. And you can see here that these are the people that I've interacted with. Uh, and at this early stage, the interaction between my, my peers isn't significant at this stage. Uh, the persona classifies my interaction patterns. And it's saying that at the moment I'm a responder, which basically means that that I give, which is shown here in the red, more than, than I receive. Uh, and I'm sort of comfortable with that at this early stage because my interaction level is, is five stars. So it's pretty much saying that I'm probably one of the most active on teams with Swoop. You can see the other in other personas here. We have the engager, which is our aspirational persona where there's a good balance between what you give and what you receive. Uh, there's also the, uh, the catalyst and that's somebody who can actually get a lot back from what they contribute, which is energizing, if you like, the community, the responder that I am, as I've already described. We also have two uh, less positive personas we call the broadcaster, somebody who posts a lot but doesn't get much back in return, and also the observer who's, who's largely inactive. By way of contrast, I've just switched over to uh, our Swoop for Yammer product and my personal tab. And as you can see, there's an awful lot more activity, the from and the to if you like. And my persona on Yammer is, is an engager, which means that I'm balancing pretty well what I'm giving and what I'm receiving. And of course, you can see here that uh, the network map is, is much more engaging, at least on the swoop side. And, and some of these connections here are actually external connections. Back to my personal tab on Teams. Now looking beyond the swoop persona and network map, we have some other widgets here. The two-way relationships is a measure of reciprocity and thankfully my score is 100% which can be seen on the network map as well because the, the, the links to, to the people I'm interacting with is coloured red. Also with the mentions index which uh, measures how much I tag people in with mentions. I'm pretty much on the organisational average here but you can see the, the big impact it has when I include a mention versus when I don't include a mention. Uh, the Curiosity Index, again, I'm pretty much on the average. Uh, the impact, though, is, is slightly less than, or a lot less than I mentioned, and quite different, I guess, to what we're used to seeing in, in Yammer, where a question tends to generate quite a lot of interactions back. Um, as somebody who's really trying to uh, influence the organisation to using Teams more, I, I am active in quite a number of, of our early teams, and uh, some of those are quite quite engaging. And I also can see... Uh, the posts that I've made that uh, create, create the most reactions and so forth. Well that's all for the personal tab on Swoop for Teams. Look out for the follow-up videos on the Business Segment tab, the Enterprise tab and the series of videos on the different team types. And thank you for your attention.